Hello everyone. It's still south of us at 120 miles, 25 miles per hour. It's down to a category three. Um, the yellow bands are just going to get here. The wind is picking up. Um, so the outer big bands are coming in here in a few minutes and about 15 minutes or so they'll be here. Um, down south of us in uh, Laplace, a relative has uh, water seeping into the house because the wind is driving it sideways under the seat holes at the bottom of the wall. So pray for them. Um, another one, it, it, he just said it was so loud and then hail was starting. Um, that's a sign of tornadic activity. Um, but they're okay. Um, my son just said he's alive and they're down in the Thibodeau, Homa area. Um, no electricity down there, of course. Um, as soon as this passes, they'll be starting up generators, etc., and cleaning up this mess. So as they come out of it, they're still in it, but um, you know, you, this thing's pretty big. So even when you go through the top of it, the circle, you still have the bottom. Um, the ones I spoke to about earlier, um, Kenner area, Norco, Laplace, uh, Metairie, up in that area, that's kind of suburbs of New Orleans, they're getting hit hard because they're in that northeast quadrant. Now this thing is going to drive, it looks like, right over us. Um, now if we can stay to the west of it, the better off we are. The better off we are. So I hope it shifts more east, but as you can see, the trees are starting to um, really move. You can see them over there. Um, we worry, we have trees in the back. Y'all have seen those trees. I have high, high pine trees. Hope they fall, they go in the other direction towards the north. But with this hurricane, your winds can wrap around. We can still get north winds depending on location. So we're worried about the trees, but it is what it is. Um, we're more concerned about the people south of us who've um, had a rough time of it, even though we haven't really been through it yet. Uh, the wind's gonna start racing, whistling. It's gonna get dark. So you're not gonna be able to see much of anything. Um, I will try and keep you updated, even if it's in the dark. Uh, Y'all have a good rest of the evening and continue to pray for us down here, please. Thank you. Oh, and here's something funny. <laughs> My brother-in-law said he's going through the water coming through the sea poles of his house. He said, waiting for this hurricane to pass is like wait is like waiting is ha like having a turtle stalk me. <laughs> he feels like he's being stalked by a turtle. Anyway, we just want it to push through and it slowed down and that's causing problems. So pray for it to speed up, not in wind mass, but just speed up and move and get through here. And for the winds to not be as severe and calm down, calm down. Oh, all right, I will talk to you later. Bye for now. Wait, look at that. I don't know if you can see that geese flying by. A crazy bird. He needs to go take shelter. Anyway, all right. Bye for now.